Okay, well, first of all, I, I wanted to come here because of one reason and, and one word, and, and that's immutability. Um, I think that that's very important. So uh, I, I commend Ethereum Classic for actually uh, taking the, the move in that direction for immutability. Um, and with respect to the, to the larger opportunity for Ethereum Classic um, around the smart contracts and the, and the programmability and the scripting language, um, I think it still remains to be seen whether or not uh, this will be done in an Ethereum or Ethereum Classic environment uh, versus uh, a, a, an enhanced uh, scripting and, and opcode stack uh, within the Bitcoin protocol. I think it would be, it'll be protocol level, it'll be enabling a, a new class of applications. And I think that Ethereum with smart contracts has done that. And I think Ethereum Classic needs to go beyond that and do something else that is a value add that is uh, differentiated from the other guys. The way I think about smart contract world is that smart contracts are very, very complicated and very, very cool. And the problem with them is that they're so complicated that there's not that much that you can reliably do with them yet. So, to my mind, the number one thing that we need to see happen in the smart contract world is working on the systems which are going to make smart contracts more reliable. I'm going to be taken away from this event that the uh, regulatory compliance and the banking industry that's driving a lot of the decisions is also being taken very seriously by the cryptocurrency community as well. And in particular efforts by the Ethereum Classic community to retain an immutable blockchain uh, really connects with a lot of the requirements around the certainty and due diligence that the industry will need to be undertaking. Uh, in order to see the adoption of public blockchains. I think one of the reasons for why the Ethereum Classic Twitter account is so successful is that, uh, you know, it's just, um, it's a voice for the community. And I do really, really try to try and represent uh, all sectors, all parts of the community. If you have a project, uh, feel free to reach out to me. Um, it's important for all members to uh, communicate with one another because that's what's going to make us successful.